Hello, welcome back to Falcon Blues TV. TV. You filthy animals, I've not that many. <laughs> hey Phil, happy birthday, big Phil. 30 today. Up the fucking toffees, hey Phil. I didn't know it was your birthday, but I've seen all boss pictures of you online on Instagram. And good luck to the 12 East Arts team, the Kirby Sports Bar. Sorry, Jay, I would give good luck to the Falcons team, but none of them subscribe, so that's that's how the cookie, cookie crumbles. But anyway, we're here to do well. We've got Bournemouth tomorrow, like, but, you know, it's League Cup. Look, we all know what I'm here for. It's weekly this now. Number 97, going on the list. Jay, knock, knock. Who's there? James. James who? Exactly. Exactly. James who? Ugh. This cretin. Now, if you're thinking, what, what's James Corden done that deserves to go on the list? What hasn't he done? What hasn't he done? Now, it may not be nothing to do with Everton. Then again, he's a West Ham fan. He's probably said something about Everton. Now, I've always hated this prick. Always. Haven't I, Jay? Haven't I always called him out? And guess who's been proved right the last week? This guy. He's been accused of being rude to people in restaurants. Fucking prick. And my favourite part, he's been stealing people's jokes. He's ripped off Ricky Gervais. He's ripped off Noel Fielding. He's ripped off some female comedian in New York. Now, what I really think about that, my honest opinion, he don't write his jokes. He's got like 10, 12 writers. I think some of them, I've seen these jokes and thought, hey, this guy is such a prick. Let's stitch him up. So congratulations, James Corden. You are number 97. And you know what? I have thoroughly enjoyed this downfall the last few weeks. All I'm waiting for is like, we need something else. Something like a proper cherry on the cake. A real scandal. Like Kevin Spacey type scandal. You know what I mean? He looks like a seedy guy. Now I know that saying that. As someone who knows a few seedy people. But still, he just looks like a wrong one. And I'm going to say it. I'm just going to say it. Gavin and Stacey. Dog shit. Absolute dog shit. Overrated. Ugh. The guy who plays fucking Gavin. Awful actor. But anyway, Corden. Oh, I did. I'm just dying to get him off me telly. I hate him, mate. If he's he's got everything, he's in every film, he's at every opening. If I open a can of beans, a tin of beans, I think he'd show up. Just to fucking dunno, tell me how to make it. But oh, I was made up getting him on it because I just can't stand him. So bad. Like that. Thanks, thanks, yeah. Do you remember why you went on the list, lad? No. Because you said I look like him. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he wish he looked like this, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, but that is 97. I know number 98 is. He's coming next week. And I know number 99 is, and I definitely know who Mr. 100 is. But what we're going to do, because the World Cup's coming up, and no one gives a fuck about it because Ireland aren't in it, we're going to do 98, 99, and I'm going to go through the list. I'm going to go through a video 1 to 25, 25 to 50, etc. We are going to review them all. All those pricks, all those gob sites, all those knobheads. We're going to go through each one of them, including me, who's on it. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> and you. <laughs> but that's just how it is. So I've been playing Bournemouth tomorrow. Um, what time are you leaving, Jay? 12. What time are you leaving, Sappy? 7. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, um, I don't know about you guys. Look, now, look, I'd love to see us win the League Cup, but I think there's more pressing matters. I would rather focus on the League game. That being said, you know, there's a lot of players who've been on the bench who are probably dying for the game. Uh, there's players who need to get fit. Um, predictions? I don't know. I, I think Bournemouth are doing really well this season. I, I, I do. I think they're a hard-working team. I think Gary O'Neill's done really well since he's took over. Uh, but I'm going for a... I'm going to go for a one-all and Everton to win on pens, which never happens, but... Things change, you know what I mean? Look at James Corden. <laughs> Three weeks ago, he was living the life, honey. <laughs> Not so much now, James. And I oh, I can't tell you how much I've enjoyed it. You know, Jay, because I've talked about it. I've got up every scandal about him. I've been Googling it as well. Uh, I reckon we could start a rumour on this, you know. I reckon we could start a rumour that allegedly James Corden touches dogs. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, get that trending, boys. And girls and non binaries. James Gordon interferes with dogs, allegedly. That's what I heard. Sources tell me. But anyway, watch your predictions for tomorrow. Who do you want to see going on the list? Don't forget to subscribe. You fucking better subscribe. This is free. And click the bell. Once you've subscribed, get your mates phone and subscribe and all. Up the fucking toffees. Sometimes I wish I was Colin Chunk. <laughs>